And now, News Channel 10's 24-7 local weather first alert forecast, sponsored by Generator Supercenter of Amarillo. Hi, Kevin Setley in the Weather Center. Kind of an interesting forecast for the weekend, especially Saturday across the Panhandle, especially around the edges of the region. Got a red flag warning from noon until 10 p.m. That's interesting in and of itself. It goes kind of later in the evening. This is windy conditions, dry conditions, low humidities, high fire danger. But those usually tend to be expired in the early evening around sunset. But this one goes until 10 p.m. coming up on Saturday. So kind of interesting setup there. Now we've got a chance for some showers, thunder showers across the eastern portions of the region and also a windy day coming up. By 7 p.m., sustained winds out of the southwest will be 20 to 30 miles per hour and gusting a little higher at times. Let's talk humidity values. Not too bad in the morning, but watch the dry lines sweep eastward across the panhandle by later in the day. Many stations going down into single digits, so that's part of the red flag morning. We got the dry conditions, we got the windy conditions, we got the warm conditions, and again, 6% humidity in the afternoon by, for Amarillo, 5% in Clovis and Hereford, 4% by late afternoon, early evening in Portales. So let's talk about the severe weather risk. It's pretty low for the panhandle, but any storms that can develop on the dry line, and the dry line may shift a little bit, much like we saw on Thursday and then last weekend, that storms may develop right near the border or in our eastern county. So the general idea is be aware late afternoon, thunderstorms that develop will do so quickly and they could become severe very quickly. Severe weather is likely across Oklahoma and on up into Kansas in the red area. That's the moderate category or the highest risk area, second highest risk area for severe thunderstorms. Again, later in the day Saturday and on into Saturday night. So we'll put a 10% chance for scattered showers, thunder showers. That's probably a little bit higher to the east, but zero for the central and western portions of the region. Very windy day, winds gusting over 30 miles per hour in the afternoon. Very warm day, very dry day, 95 for the high. It's a little cooler, a little less windy on Sunday. Then Monday, 88 degrees for the high. Then next week starts to look interesting. We've got a series of disturbances coming by, which increases the chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms and possibly severe weather. Now, we'll amend that forecast as we go on through the weekend, but Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, even into the following weekend, looks like hit and miss showers and thunderstorms do become much more likely.